Hey guys, the objective of this video is to derive expressions for Vx and Vy for a projectile. So we're going to be after the velocity in the x direction and the velocity in the y direction for a standard projectile. And with these, we're also going to be working out the displacement in the x direction and the displacement in the y direction at any time t. So we have a situation like this where we have a projectile being launched with an initial velocity of v at an angle of theta. Um, and we are going to try and find the velocity at any time, so the x component and the y component at any time, and we're going to try to find the displacement in the x direction and the y direction at any time. So we'll start off by looking at the horizontal, horizontal components. So this is the easy bit, the horizontal component, uh, because when we consider horizontal velocity as a function of time, we know that the acceleration in the x direction is equal to zero, and that's because um, that's as a result of Newton's first law, which just basically says that an object will keep moving unless it's acted on by an external force. And in the x direction, there is no external force that is acting on it. So whatever velocity it's launched with um, in the x direction, it will keep until it lands. Um, so basically we can write that as, so Vx is just going to be equal to the x component of the initial velocity, and it's not going to depend on time. So it's going to be um, independent of time. So if we find the x component of this, we're going to have, it's going to be v, uh, the x component is cos, so cos theta. And that is our um, expression for.